Pradero. I'm Archie Molina. Your NASA researchers. This video, we are going to showcase our different interviews towards our teachers and different students from different schools on how important a specific calculus and statistic is in our life. So we have here our first participant, a great job student STEM from Notre Dame Academy, Ms. Dina Grace Bulatini. So first question, what is the importance of basic calc and statistics in your daily life as a STEM student? So when it comes to basic calculus and statistics, well, well clearly basic calculus is actually a difficult subject, especially for STEM students, and considering that it tackles a lot of um, theories and solutions and calculations. But for me, the importance of basic calculus and statistics in our daily life is that you can apply the theories that are being used in basic calculus and for statistics, well, clearly in our case as a grade 12 student, it is very much important for us since we use statistics as part of our research to prove and to make conclusions out of our out of the data coming from our study. So here is the second question. What leads you to take STEM strand? <laughs> So first of all, okay, uh, the reason that I only take up STEM, STEM strand is because I have um, interest in the field of science and technology. Also, I'm planning to take up course to take up a course which is a medicinal course that is aligned with STEM strand. So that's the main reason that I only take up STEM strand. Also, the opportunities that are STEM strand, which is and more scholarships na may ka-offer okay. most scholarships na mag-aaral ng companies kaya ipangita nila ng mga graduates kaya mga STEM students okay. para na po sa kailang, kailang kompanya so mojo na siya ang main reason na nang join po STEM What are the challenges you have made in teaching physical and statistics? Well, ang um, challenges yun nga ako na-face na kapag in 11 ako while well, detake up one ang doon ka subject is that sa physical yun kaya difficult yun siya Kay, one man, you'd see ako ng, in general, if ako lang yun, generalized with ng basic calculus, kasi hindi na siya ng course. Then, also, sa statistics, kaya ang nakalisa sa statistics, kaya ka na taas kay iyang process. Dahil, if nalang ganit kayo ma-miss out, kasi ako sa ka, kung ano na, o sa ka, miscalculation, ano, naka na-miscalculate, ano, kay masayop na dyan, dahil ang imuhang end, nga, ang final nga answer. So, mugi na siya ang challenges na bring sa basic calculus o sa Fourth question, how can you overcome these challenges? So, to overcome those challenges in basic calculus and statistics, kay, first, kini mong batang kay ayaw, good ka nang hadloki ang ka nang subject, kay ka nang mga lusod ng butang, kay naro mo dyan ay lusod, uh, ka nang mata ng lima, naro dyan ay solusyon. So, first, kini mong ka nang batang yung mong sa ka nang challenge, kay ayaw, hadloki ang subject, kaya mo to kay next food, kaya ka nang dili lang food, kaya ka nang limit sa yung mong self, sa kung sige tulad sa maestro ninyo, meaning, you have to kanang explore beyond what is being given to you then kani cliche jud kini siya pero tuon lang jud pag tuon lang jud mo kay wala mo sa kanang buwan wala mo sa kay maku wala mo sa kay ingon nga wala kay makuha or like kanang wala kay butang nga dili makuha out of learning from that subject so more gyud na siya kumo kay man thank you miss dinya grace bilakinya for cooperating with us and for sharing your knowledge Thank you, thank you. So here is our second and third respondents, Mr. Seth, Xavier, Servo, and Lorenzo Kamike. So our first question, what is the importance of basic calculus and statistics in your daily life as a STEM student? During an STEM strand, we focus mainly on math and science. Therefore, statistics and probability gives us a better, better knowledge and a better comprehension in our studies. And also, 
for future courses like engineering or any any science or mathematics related courses. Statistics and probability offers a wide scope of knowledge as foundation for science. Our second question: What leads you to take the STEM strategy? STEM is a very good idea. I plan to be an engineer so I'm going to be related to STEM. I took STEM strand because science is maybe one of my favorite subjects. And also STEM strand also focuses on science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. It should be a better foundation for college courses like engineering. Because engineering is one of my favorite subjects. Our well, third question: What are the challenges you have met taking basic calculus, statistics, and probability? Uh, so the challenges that I faced while taking being, while taking statistics and probability would be first and foremost the ability to comprehend because it's a great challenge to comprehend. Numbers should be used to probably because we do math. That also another challenge that I found hard in statistics and probability is that statistics and probability are subjects na isud gan kaya sa tuon pasa pasa statistics na yung extra yung pasa explanation. Kisa ko ang challenge yung di na ordinary plan yung mga statistics na yung subjects na statistics na basic pa kung tapay pa kung tapay pa Kaya naman ang pangit sa pagsulod ni mga problem sa mga kaya kung kaya sa mga dito ako sa mga sulod ni kapag pagnanda na mga kaya niya eh pero kapag kaya na ang mga sasalig na chang chang kaya hindi ko tapat na kaya kasi numbers game may dins kaya dapat hindi ko na yung kapag sa mga tapos sa mga kasi na mga digits kasi na mga numbers na hindi ka mag sa dito sa mga dito so kaya kung yung mga matali ka pa ng mga number o sa dito sa so our fourth and last question, how did you overcome these challenges? So first and foremost, I overcome these challenges through hard work, hard work and perseverance in understanding and comprehending the topics because it's really hard to comprehend, to understand the discussion of Chiron because I don't So, for the first challenge case, it's not easy to do it, but for me, it's not easy to do it. It's not easy to do it, but for me, it's not easy to do it. It's not easy to do it. Kami ang i-adapt na yung mga kung sa, ay i-adapt yung kung sa ang naagi ngayon sa pagpasa sa isang pagpasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasasas
struggling in understanding about these calculus and statistics. So our fourth and last question. How did you overcome these challenges? I overcome these challenges by studying well and working hard for those two subjects and follow the formulas and studying study it. Studying those subjects properly. So thank you Mr. Xavier Basan for cooperating with us and sharing us your knowledge. So we have here May, Miss May Janine Salon from Karkar Academy, a grade 12 student. Here is the first question. What is the importance? What is the importance of basic calculus and statistics in your daily life as a STEM student? The importance of basic calculus and statistics in our daily life as a STEM student is that it, it helps us especially in basic calculus and it helps us to know more the measurements of a thing and in, in statistic is that it helps us to give conclusion and the data is being gathered. What leads you to take the STEM strand? So I choose the STEM strand because Courses in STEM are more in demand, which I can use whenever I want to pursue what I want to be in near future. So here is the third question. What are the challenges you have met in taking basic calculus and statistics? How can you overcome these challenges? The challenges that I have met is that when I miscalculate equations and when I had hard time understanding the lesson and I overcome it by studying, it and following the formulas and exploring new things. So thank you, Miss Janine Maisalon, for sharing, cooperating with us and sharing us your knowledge. So here is our math teacher, Janelle Sir, our first question. What is the importance of teaching basic calculus and statistics and probability in your daily life? Okay, first, First, I'm going to teach students since we talk about statistics, it's all about gathering data, and the importance of studying statistics. The first very common example of that is you will know how to compute your average grade, or no? one of the basic yun. Pinakula na katunan, and you can bring this study about statistics. Yes, and then of course, we can, we can apply that uh, in our daily life, no? since uh, we all know that we have a time of our life of like it in mathematics. When we go to market, and of course, hindi na ito kalita yan. Siyempre, some cases of our life or some situation of our life, wala ka magkibaw na even though nagpatitulang something sa Gaisano, sa market, wala ka magkibaw, kasi ay na-apply na ang statistic yan. That's why it's very important. Ipotanto ko siya, madapat yun. Uh, as a teacher, we need to learn by learning about the tamu as a student. Like to know about the tamu lang ang mga study. It's a big no. It's because as a teacher, dalaman ko din mga study. Since bilik ni mo tumlo sa inyo ba? Bilik ni siguran mo sa mga tumlo. Basic, panangli, nagtunod-tunod lang eh. And then, for example, bilik man sila kalikayan. And in some cases, ganagin yung mga sudyanting na parang mas 
Tugi mo kanto ba? Kada sila mga pampana. Kung sa ano mo, pag ang sila sila ang pampana, wala ang kulidaan ng mga 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 topic na nagiskasin mo. And then, may problema, may problema sa mga. Ang pagtuon ay simpulang. Ang problema sa mga is student. Kamo. Since, ang pina kami focus na mga sa teacher is makatong mong dumay. Makatong mong dumay. Ang yan, di mo na ito kalikayan yun na may mga pastor na student. Hindi sila ito kalikayan na nandiyan yung mga slow learner. Sa mga 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 as a teacher, need to prepare Ano itong example? Simple, complex, mga ito. First na mong buhagi nila. Pinakauna na mong buhagi nila. Biligyo ay dun! Ang umulagi na mong ihatag sa mga students since mga magiging yung mga challenge. Pinakaunang challenge, kung sa ako na mong pagpagintang pahal, na magdungan mong takpon ka na. So, ang pinagin na mong ihatag po ng example is, siyempre, simple na example. Simple example, and then, sa picture, kung ma-observe na lang mo, na parang na-learn, na-learn na mga bata, na parang simple na lang sila, na parang na-learn na mga simple na mga problem, and then that's the time, ang mga hatag na tinungan, so isa ko na mga, until such time na makita din mo na, ah, nalapang lagi silang ganan. Lalit lagi din nila natapos. Basic calculus and statistics and probability plays an important role towards our life. Some may say these are useless, but I am here in this video. I want to tell that basic calculus and statistics is very important in our life. That's because of them, they are the reason behind what we have and what we see. The successful and great scientists, engineers, architects, doctors, and nurses they use this as a powerful weapon towards a powerful and a wonderful world we live in. So, as of this day, we, STEM students, should give importance in basic calculus and statistics and probability because in the near future, we will serve as a good leader towards the upcoming youth. I'm Lar Preyosa. And I'm Giovanni Paradero. Mamba out. Hello. And I'm Arvin Dicatoria. I'm Archie Baginang. I'm Adrian Victor Mendoza. 